What's going on world? It's your homie Sensei Rip and I'm back again with another video. Today we got Boosie reacting to Kanye West speaking on George Floyd in his recent Drink Champs interview. For those who may have missed it, let's hear the clip and hear exactly what Kanye had to say. And I will catch you afterwards with Boosie's reaction, alright? So with that being said, let's get right to it. I, I watched the George Floyd documentary that Candace Owens put up. One of the things that his two roommates said was, they want a tall guy like me. They want a tall guy like me. And the day when he died, he said a prayer for, you know, eight minutes. Mm -hmm. He said a prayer for eight minutes. They hit him with the fentanyl. If you look, the, the guy's knee wasn't even on his neck like that. When he said, mama, mama his, is his girlfriend. They said he screamed for his mama. Mama was his girlfriend, it's in the documentary. But something that hit me, that fucked me up when I was watching the documentary, and it said they want a tall guy like me. When I looked at that image of him, this tall black dude with the bald head, he reminded me of somebody else. Who do you think he reminded me of? Virgil. He reminded me of Virgil. You know what I'm saying? I'm not finna cry in front of y'all because that's right. how they get me, right? All right? But I know that we lost him. And I know that this white company, Louis Vuitton, is now making statues of him, like right. as a martyr. And we don't know why exactly. We say it's cancer. But I yeah. mean, I mean, um, mm -hmm. all right, I want to be careful with this subject because. Wait a second, but tell me, mm -hmm. could you even really run this interview? Because Mav yeah. didn't run my interview. Right. You got know what I'm saying? They blocked me out. The Jewish media blocked me out. Well. After seeing the clip, Boosie decided to react via Twitter with a post that reads, You really have a deep hatred in your heart for black people. First you said slavery was a choice, then white lives matter, now George Floyd. And ain't nobody gonna tell your ass you sick for doing this to our race. Shaking my head. Well, I am. Hashtag just do it. If you think you white, just do it. Then... He followed up with another post that says, trying to shit on George Floyd and F up his glory. Shaking my head. Hashtag really. I think you on fentanyl. All right. Now, again, this is Boosie's reaction to Kanye West speaking on George Floyd in his recent Drink Champs interview. Like I said, uh, earlier this morning, we had a reaction from Steven Jackson. Once again, Kanye has outdid himself. Right. Just when you think he's unsaid enough outlandish things. Right. Uh, whether it was in the TMZ rant. Right. The, the MAGA hat. Here we go. Another quote from Kanye speaking on George Floyd and how the knee really wasn't on his neck like that. I mean, when you hear stuff like this from Kanye, you have to question the sanity of this man. You have to ask yourself, is he trolling right now? Now, again, in all fairness, people will say, well, he was referring to this documentary that was put out by Candace Owens. I haven't watched it. I have no intentions on watching it because at the end of the day, me, myself, I never subscribe to this BLM ideology. You know, I do believe in, you know, the fight that we have amongst our people. You know what I'm saying? Black people in America have been fighting for centuries at this point. So this was way before the organization was hijacked by George Soros. I understand that. But as you can see, with the Pamela Turner verdict that just passed this week, we're still out here fighting for justice. You get what I mean? So when Kanye chooses this uh, platform to speak on how he feels about George Floyd, I just think it's crazy to me that, the, that he doesn't have the awareness and the understanding that, yo, even if you felt like that personally about George Floyd and his death, you don't have to say that on this platform. What about the family of George Floyd? What about his daughter? Kanye, in the same interview, got upset because other people weren't defending him when he felt like he and his family was being attacked. Come on now. That's what I mean about the contradiction. All right? No one's trying to make this man out to be crazy or insane. Your actions and your words do enough of that already. You know? I get it. Times Kanye makes points, but then another... He always contradicting himself. But y'all let me know. What's your thoughts on Boosie's reaction? And how did you feel when Kanye said what he said about George Floyd? All right. So with that being said, that's all I got for y'all today. My name is Sensei Rip. Till next time. Peace.